to our graduation. Now, for those who don't know, our graduations are a little different than other high schools because they're about us. No boring speeches from faculty that you never see. Now, <laughs> now this year, we, the class of 2018, we've gone through a lot. The crippling senioritis, the tests, the homework, college applications, FAFSA, school events, everything. But more than this year, we went through all of our years to get to this moment. And I, for one, couldn't be more proud of everyone graduating here tonight. This, this school year's theme was more, and not to sound as cheesy as possible, but I think that that idea, do more, be more, really encapsulates our class. So many of us want to go into such different fields of work and did so many different things in high school because we wanted to be more than who we were at the beginning. We are so inclusive of different kinds of people, especially now, because of our desire to be more than just one opinion or viewpoint. We've done more academically than almost all of the other classes before us, and we're physically more because we are one of the largest classes that North Point has ever seen. But we are more because of the people that have supported us along the way, whether they be a teacher, a coach, a family member, or a friend. And we've made a lot of memories together, like watching Kareem get second place in the belly flop freshman year. Our questionable class themes, though there is a special place in my heart for Garfield and Shrek. <laughs> to this year, with all of our senior trips and Zach finally winning the belly flop for us. But I, I could go on, but I think you all understand. We are more for the memories that we've made and for the people that we are now. Though some haven't changed, others have changed completely. So now, we are going to be poking fun at some of you, not all of you, sorry, but some of you. First, we're going to show a picture from 7th grade, and then a picture from 12th grade, and, but it's all good fun. So, who better to kick it off than with me? So I know I was really ugly back in 7th grade, but I feel like I've improved a little bit. So. obviously changed, but some people in our class have not changed at all. For example, Zena. No offense, I love you, but I think the only thing you learned how to do in high school was smile a little bit, you know? Put your head up. Uh, next, we have Jacob, who has the exact same haircut, the exact same. That. He has the same haircut, the same facial expression, the same head tilt, everything is the same. Next we have Fernanda. Fern, you have the same facial expression in both, although your hair is much better now, thank goodness. I'm kidding, I love you. So next we have Brian. almost exactly the same, you just took your hair off a little bit, you know, you just got rid of those bangs, but I think you look very nice. Yeah. Next we have Justin. I mean, all you did in those two pictures was close your lips a little bit. I mean, <laughs> Next we have Mercedes. that those two pictures changed was you put on a pair of glasses, and that's a good thing. I mean, you look beautiful in both. Next, we have Zach. Zach, you just, you look a little bit angrier in the second picture. I'm really not sure what happened to you, but I hope you're okay. Next, we have Justice. So, for those 
those who don't know Justice, I think the only thing that has changed between those two pictures is now he's a little bit taller. You know? So now let's check in. Now let's check in on the twins. We have Court. Court, I swear, those two pictures were taken probably two days apart. Like. And now we'll check in on Colette. Change. You got a new haircut, but is that really changing? Because she changed, but just her style did. So now we're going to go into more people whose style changed, like John. All you did was add a beard. You just, you just added a beard. Uh, but some people, some people grew their hair out, like Kenzie. style changed by putting their hair back, like Daniel. Some people decided to cut it all off, like Sean. Some people, again, grew it out, like Ovid. And some people went for a double whammy and grew it out and colored it, like Kenley. Now, Noah, I am so glad that you got rid of your bangs. And I am so glad that you stopped letting your mom cut your hair. Kenya, everything... Everything in style changed about you. You, you got a new glasses, you got a new hair, you got a new outfit, and I mean, your lipstick's really nice, but you can definitely still rock both of those looks. Now, Kareem, I don't really think... <laughs> Kareem, between these two pictures, I don't think there's a... Hold on, that's, that's a seventh grade brother. <laughs> Oops, yikes, okay, there it is. I mean, to be fair, you did change a lot. Just like how Eden changed. She went from being... I think in the second picture, or in the first picture, she looks more like a, uh, either an old first grader or a young fourth grader. <laughs> or maybe like Daniel. I mean, look at his expression, even he's shocked. <laughs> or maybe like JJ. <laughs> JJ, I think you might want to go back to the left picture. I mean, both are good. I mean, you still have the shirts, but... Or like Osman. <laughs> Osman, I mean, you lost all of your baby fat, like go you. I'm still trying to get that out. Or maybe like Jesse. <laughs> Jesse, between these two pictures, I'm not gonna talk about you now, but between these two pictures, all kinds of stuff happened. Like you got rid of that plaid on regular shirt, you got a whole bunch of hair like every which way, but I mean, good on you. So next we have Carly. side of your head. And I mean, you never know when your ID is going to be used again. So this is your ID picture. I love you and you can definitely, you still look good. But I'm just saying. But our winner for most changed is Siklaley. Because I, I mean, I really don't know where to begin. That 70s hair? That 70s shirt? That 70s show? That 70s glasses? Like, I mean, you, is that perm? I mean, either way, you still, you look fantastic now. But, you know, regardless, as you guys can clearly see, over the years we've changed a lot. Especially these past four years. And we've had a lot of fun. Now, for 
those who see us on social media and are wondering if we ever go to class, the answer is no. I mean, <laughs> we try to go as little as possible. <laughs> but it is about the fun and about the people that you share with. 